welcome back to episode two of this amazing show. Why did they smash our box? I'm sorry, did, did uh, Ace Ventura deliver this to us personally? <laughs> Down the it's, stairs. It came in the mail like this. I went home and I picked it up, and it was smashed. Out <laughs> it was just smashed in the corner. I guess the mailman just he took an elevator and just held, held it there while the elevator smashed it over and over. <laughs> <laughs> This one's from Japan, I think, is what I said last time. I believe it is what you said last time. So we'll see. We'll see what's in this box. I'm much more interested in this one than I was with Canada. Me too. Yeah. No offense to Canada, but it's very similar to A little to offense to Canada. Kind of offense to Canada. It's too similar but, to America. I mean, With yeah. the snacks, at least. I love a lot of things about Japan. Let's open it up. Why don't you take this box from me and we'll open it up. Okay. 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 Well, I guess uh, that, was, that was it for Snack Crate. Thanks for stopping by, guys. Are we good? All right, you ready? One, two. Oh wait, here's a hot tip. Ooh, hot tip, hot tip alert. Summer. Hot tip alert, hot tip alert. Woo! Love to read it. Summer is here, and that means some items can melt or get soft in warmer temperatures during transit. We recommend placing your crate in the fridge for three or four hours before enjoying the best snacking experience. I really wish I knew that. You definitely did not <laughs> do that. <laughs> Just sitting on your desk. All right, yeah, it's from Japan. So is this when you show the camera what you look right is from Japan. There you go. Japan. There's a whole like book loop this time. Late night dancing is illegal in Japan. So you can't dance late at night. So if it's like 9 p.m., I, yeah, like, I don't know. It's boogie nights, but, yeah, but then by 9:01, yeah, that's the it. prison. Sleeping on the job is completely okay in Japan. It's a scene size, a sign of hard work. Sleep at work. Can you imagine if I was in a hospital? That's pretty I, like, cool. Went to sleep at the hospital. That's pretty cool. <laughs> like, that's why don't we have that here? Because uh, it's America. Come on, America. And the last fact: in 1997, 685 kids went to the hospital due to a Pokemon show. Remember, you know that, right? Remember that? That was the the uh, when they went to what's the ghost town? In Lavender Town. Yeah. Right. When they had the like, seizures from the ghost thing. Like the, oh the yeah, picture from that episode. Remember something about do you like, remember the music flashing though? a bunch? I don't know if it may not have been that episode. I think we might be thinking of the game uh, where like the music was all messed up, like that that really creepy music. Yes, um, I'm sure you can play that. Yeah, super creepy music sent a bunch of kids to the hospital or something. I don't know, but that's the fun facts in Japan. Dude, this looks much better. Ooh, this looks a this lot looks more colorful. Crazy. Colorful. Check this out. I'm, okay, so I'm gonna let you know we can't read these. I'm gonna have to go to this. Well, why don't you try it? But, uh, <laughs> how do you pronounce the symbols? Tell me. Show you, the tell me. you tell me how I can say that. These are called uh, Tilhato Spicy Rings. Since 2003, these flaming rings of death have been burning their way around Japan. Spice Factor 5 out of 5. Can you handle this? I remember oh, we went on a video a long time ago. I know. With the hot wings at Buffalo Wild Wings. Uh, I can't. I can't do it. spice. I can't. <laughs> I can't do it. I'm dying. <laughs> I'm dying right now. Oh my god. Keep eating. Let's try it. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Uh, Are you gonna eat one? Get my spice on. I got. I have to. You have to. Let, let's smell them first. Let's, let's get, get, get your nose in there. It smells really fake. It's just always a good mm. sign for snacks. It smells like ramen noodles. I think it just smells like fake snacks. Honestly. It smells like fake. Mm, okay. All right. I'm here. It took me a minute to understand what was happening. Tastes a little bit like those uh, little ramen cups that you buy. There it is. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not trying to make a stereotype. No, 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 no. There it is. As it is hot. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Because it's hot. They are hot. Oh my goodness. Mm. <laughs> I like spicy food, but it's pretty spicy. <coughs> are you good? <coughs> you had one. You had I one. Had two. Did you? Uh, it tastes like like burn. I like them. Honestly, they taste better than the chips from the Canada one. Yeah. These chips, honestly, are, are kawaii. The next thing sitting on top is Watapachi. Watapachi grape. 
Not only so Japan is like super known for like having crazy, ridiculous artwork on their stuff. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here, but this awesome candy is a cross between cotton candy and popping candy. So it's cotton candy and pop rocks, essentially. Here you go, Pop open it up. Cotton. There's, there's a slit, don't worry, you don't have oh, to cut my fingers. Sorry. Hook me up, bruh. Uh, what? Wait, I, I, wait, I thought there were pieces. No. Oh, boy. Eee. Well, here's half for you. Wait, wait, isn't this what we find, like, in the <laughs> in the AC? Ah! We hope. It's and what, what's, like, the stuff you line your attic with? It's, like, fiberglass. Okay, so, th no, so this is fiberglass. They just, they added flavor to fiberglass, and they're making us eat it because they think we are dumb. But you know what? I see right through your lies, Japan. Japan. Let's taste the fiberglass. Cheers. Oh. Mm. I mean, it tastes oh okay. God. The texture is weird. It's very sweet. <laughs> it's really very sweet. Very rich. Yeah. There's little pieces of like white stuff in here, and I just. Are you trying? Like, is Japan trying to poison us? Yeah, is this, is this, like, part of it? Is this dust? Like, I don't know if I'm <laughs> eating dirt. On to the next. Oh my god. You okay? It's just so sweet! I like the, the pop rock part. Oh. Okay, so the next thing, sitting up here, there's a picture of pizza on this. So, we'll picture see. of pizza. Uh, um, um, Ibo. Um, 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 Ibo. I love um, Ibo. Uh, delicious. <laughs> and delicious on here is in quotes. So, <laughs> it's <yeah>. delicious. Delicious. <laughs> Delicious stick in, J in Japanese. That's that's promising. Is a puffed corn snack available in many flavors. It's like a puff. Oh man, <sighs> I really don't want to break this part. Like, it's gonna get all over the table. Uh, how about this is what this looks like? This is the pizza flavor one. How about you you bite this side, bite this side, and we do like a lady in the tramp. <laughs> lady, no, thanks. Well, lady in the tramp it. I'll grab a knife. Lady in the tramp it. <laughs> Come on. I feel like we're on a romantic <laughs> dinner. It's like a big Cheeto puff. Yeah. Like. There you go. Oh, thanks, man. I just feel like I'm my Smell body it. gains nothing from you. Sniff it. No, 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 fake beef in a pastry, or like in a puff. Oh man, I can't. Uh, Alright, let's do it. That makes me cringe, let's smelling it. it. I'm sure it doesn't taste as bad as it smells. Mmm. That's so good. Mm. <laughs> it's so good. One more? A lot? I'll eat the whole thing, I mean. I honestly I don't even taste that much. It like disappears before I even can taste it. It's too like puffy. It's like a Cheeto puff. It's not good though. It's not good. So I guess why they put delicious in quotes. <laughs> well, here's the. Uh, this is the chicken one. This is the curry chicken. This one's yellow. I can't do it again. You have to. <laughs> Cheers. Oh boy. It's fine dining. This one's better. This is better. Yep. That's for sure. I'm not gagging anymore. That's this one's a better. Plus. I'm not gonna say it's good, but I'm not gagging. So it's seriously progress is it key. really tastes like a Cheeto puff, but it's just flavored with like gross stuff. <laughs> Honestly. On to the next one. The next one. Hey! Are these what I think they are? are they? Oh they are! Oh, They're high shoes. Cover. High chews are good, man. They're really good, actually. Here's a high chew for you. Yes! Okay. Grape's not the best flavor, really. Like, I don't like grape that much. If there's another fruit, I'd eat them all for sure. But, it's still good. High chews. Okay. Didn't know they came from Japan, but good job. Those are good. Oh, good. You want to read some of the ingredients? Give it a shot. Domo oregato, misto robato. Oh, this. Sakupan? Sakupan. I don't know how to pronounce it. Sakupan? Sakupan chocolate Monica. I'm still chewing on this daffy. Monaca Monica. I'm so white. Delicious wafer. 
filled with bubbly milk and white chocolate layers in the shape of a super cute panda. I don't think like the description of bubbly makes milk sound better to me. Aww. 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 It's a panda. Aww. It's like a cookie. It's such a cookie. It's a panda cookie. Here you go. Cheers, mate. Sorry, I got I blacked out for a second. Cheers, friend. So it's waffle in this, definitely. It's kind of bland. I mean, it's sweet. But like, I don't get the like chocolate flavor out of it. It's like the the wafer part overpowers everything else for me. Maybe just because I ate the corner. <laughs> it's just like any normal wafer with like filling, I guess. Okay. So this is a solid, meh. It's okay. What's next, Trevor? There's these uh, green tea Kit Kats, which I'm really excited for. Me too. I like green tea, and I know Japan does green tea really well. It's green. Yeah, it's green tea. I'm really excited. I have high expectations for this. Cheers. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. It's pretty for good. Sure. This is probably up there with the best we've This is the so best. Far. This might be the best thing I've had in a snack crate. I think we've only done two, but yeah, this is good. Not bad, Japan. I'll give you this one. I'm gonna make it here, dude. But I'm keeping so my good. eye on you, Japan. Oh yeah, we read this earlier. Because Kit Kats are not Japanese, yet they're among the most popular candies due to their name, meaning you will do well in Japanese. Kit Kat yes. means you will do well in Japanese. Hmm? Did the people who made Kit Kat did they know? That it meant that I'm going, they, I'm going to assume that they did not. <laughs> I'm gonna start using Kit Kat. Kit Kat. Just say that. Hey, Kit Kat. Kit Kat. What are you talking, Kit Kat? No, I don't want Kit Kat. Kit Kat. Hey, dude. Kit Kat. Hey, bro. Kit Kat. <laughs> People will probably want to punch you. All right. The next thing in here is uh, Choco Balls. One of the most iconic Japanese candies. I can't wait for these Choco Balls, bro. Nice, bro. Get some choco balls up in this. Yeah. A lot more chewy than I expected. It's caramel. They taste exactly like milk buns. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> There's only like a finite amount of combinations you can do with candy, I guess. You're a finite amount of combinations. That's true. And they're good. I like milk dads, so. Man, bring on the Maynards. <laughs> so much chewing. <laughs> These are, uh... Take your time. We'll wait. Here we go. These are, uh, Apollo. They're called Apollo. These small chocolates are shaped like the tips of rockets and are made up of a milk chocolate base and strawberry chocolate top. There's a little, a little bunny in there. It's a wheel bunny, bunny with the cool chocolate. Man. Let me get that for you. Okay. I'm trying to open it for you. Mm. You know, I like that noise. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, it's that one right there, right? Okay, so like it's the pinkish strawberry and mm. the brown chocolate. It tastes like a Hershey's Kiss. Yeah, there's some strawberry mm. flavoring. It's good. Yeah. Chocolate. Chocolate strawberries. It's good. I like them. Got a lot of spunk, Japan. I think I like you. Didn't you say that about Canada? Let's move on to the next one. The last one is Pocky, which is like pretty much the first thing I think people think of when they think of like snacks in Japan. Everyone knows what Pocky is. Everyone knows. I don't know what that is. <laughs> um, but but yeah, you can so find them anywhere. You can find them in like Walmart. They're cookie sticks, essentially. But this one, I guess, is uh, Pocky Milk. Pocky Milk. Ew. Right? Yeah, Man. it has a milk. It has a I'm just not used to like milk on there. artificial milk. They flavors. must like milk flavoring. I guess so. Oh, must be a big That's kind of weird because like we don't have things flavored like milk. We just drink milk. Yeah, we just drink milk. Uh, this is creamy melt in your mouth milk flavored coating fused into a crispy cookie stick. Open that puppy dog up. Open that puppy dog up. <laughs> Look at the packaging. Milk, milk, milk. Milk! I'm, I'm just not down with the whole milk thing. Sheer happiness. What's this? Milk. Let's find out what these taste like. I'm gonna guess milk. Cheers. 
<laughs> you know, it's not like it's a horrible taste, it's I'm just not, not used to yeah. milk. It's just weird. It's like cream, kind of. Like a cream yeah. coating, which is just different, I guess. We use it for like icing and stuff. Kinda. Yeah. As opposed to like coatings for candies. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. I think yeah. that's it. Oh, that's it! Well, yeah. shoot. That's, it. That's, that's all from Japan. Time flew by. I mean, let's, let's, um... Let's pick the worst and the best The thing. worst. I already can tell you right now the worst. Which flavor was the it The pizza. Where is it? For sure it's the pizza one. Pizza... What is it called? Pizza Puff? This is probably the worst thing it's I've ever had in my life. Um Ibo. The, the, the one with the delicious in quotes. Delicious. <laughs> okay, so what's the best thing here? Well, the best thing, I think, is the green tea Kit Kat. This bad boy. Ha! Ah! You're a cat. Do you know what is up next? It, it, it's a mystery. We're gonna find out. I think that's the point they want to do is like make it a surprise. So, so we don't know what next month is gonna be. I kind of like that. I'm kind of yeah. excited. Well, thank you for joining us on episode two of it's not this, great. this not, it's great, not great show. Great. Join us next time when we you're supposed to touch the other side of my hand like this. Oh. Um. So we will have another episode very soon. Thank you for joining us. See ya. Bye. No. These were awful, dude. <laughs> They're pretty bad. I might have nightmares about this.